Coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited, Continental Aerospace Technologies announces their partnership with Diamond Aircraft. United States Parachute Association reports record low fatalities in 2018. And Citation Jet Pilots Association announces 2019 Hoover Scholarship recipients. Happy Friday and welcome to the show. I'm your host, Sophie Herlock. Continental Aerospace Technologies will be powering Diamond Aircraft's DA-50 with their 300 HP Jet A fueled CD-300 engine. Certified back in 2017, the CD-300 produces 300 HP at 9.2 GPH and 2300 RPM. On March 22nd, the program reached a significant milestone with their first flight of the development aircraft. The next step for the company is to create a seamless flying experience through the integration of the DA-50's advanced avionics with the CD-300's dual redundant full authority digital engine control. President and CEO of Continental Aerospace Technologies, Rhett Ross said, Matching the CD-300 Jet A engine with the new DA-50 aircraft by Diamond Aircraft Industries is a rekindling of the relationship that created the original successful Jet A powered aircraft. When we return, the Sun and Fun International Fly-In announces their name change. Concorde's recombinant gas RG series sealed battery technology produces a high performance battery with the advantages of being pre-tested and fully charged at the factory. Find out more about Concorde's entire line of batteries at www.concordbattery.com. Concorde, the heart of your aircraft. Today is a new dawn. With a new name. Un nuevo logotipo. A new factor. Und einen globalen Kundenfokus. We are Continental Aerospace Technologies and we stand behind you. There's a difference between charting a steady course and pushing for the ceiling. And for nearly a century, Hartzell Propeller has been defining that difference. It's in our passion for engineering and research and our dedication to testing the limits of performance. We are built on honor. We are Hartzell Propeller. If you have any story suggestions for this, any of our other programming or website, send an email to news-spy at news.net. Welcome back. Let's take a quick look at a few stories coming out of the aviation industry in today's trip around the patch. The Sun and Fun International Flying and Expo will now be called the Sun and Fun Aerospace Expo. Sun and Fun is the largest fundraising event for the Aerospace Center for Excellence. President and CEO of Sun and Fun, John Leanhout, stated, Renaming this iconic aviation event reflects our mission to engage, educate, and accelerate the next generation of aerospace professionals. A Gulfstream G650ER has set the 90th speed record for its type, while at the same time increasing distance flown for the farthest business jet flight in history. The jet flew from Singapore to Tucson, Arizona at an average speed of 519 knots, over a distance of 8,379 nautical miles. Applications for the 2019 U.S. Air Force Test Pilot School are due Monday, May 29th. The USAF TPS Selection Board will convene at the Air Force's Personnel Center July 29th through August 2nd and will consider total force officers and current Air Force civilian applicants to attend training as early as 2020. All applicants must have strong academic and technical experience. The Collegiate Volunteer Program is currently looking for students to volunteer for the EAA Air Venture Oshkosh 2019. The program allows students to build their resume and gain hands-on experience in a wide variety of fields, 
while also getting to experience air venture at its fullest. And that was today's trip around the patch. Stick around for the rest of the news after these messages. Based on the popular Sling 2 LSA, the Sling 4 was designed to be the most practical and desirable lightweight four-place experimental aircraft on the market. Find out more about this 115 horsepower turbocharged airplane at airplanefactory.com. Build and fly with the most exciting line of kit aircraft on the market, the Sonics Aircraft B models. The B models offer more room and comfort, more fuel, more panel space, more engine choices, and the same great Sonics Aircraft flight characteristics. Learn more at sonicsaircraft.com. Sandia introduces the new SAI 340 Quattro TSO'd airspeed, attitude, altitude, and slip. With integral backup battery, safety never looked so good. See it now at www.sandia.aero. The United States Parachute Association reports in 2018, 13 people died during skydives in the U.S. This is the lowest number of fatalities since 1961, when the USPA began recording fatalities. That year, 14 parachuters died and the number of fatalities steadily increased until it began to drop in the early 1980s. In 1961, the estimated fatality rate was one fatality for every 9,000 parachute jumps. That number has improved drastically with the fatality rate for 2018 being one fatality for every 253,669 jumps. The Citation Jet Pilots Association has announced the recipients of the 2019 Bob Hoover Presidential Scholarship. This scholarship is presented in partnership between the CJP Safety and Education Foundation and the Bob Hoover Legacy Foundation. The scholarship was established to honor the aviation icon Robert A. Bob Hoover. This year's recipients are Brandon Barber, a junior at ERAU Daytona. Jacob Cook, also a junior at ERAU Daytona. Matthew Gailey, a junior at ERAU Prescott. And Otto Maytag, a sophomore at ERAU Prescott. Each student will receive $25,000 towards their aviation-related studies at Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University. Thirteen students have received the Bob Hoover Presidential Scholarship since its inception in 2013. And that wraps up things for today, folks. If you're watching us on YouTube, please subscribe and check us out on Twitter and on Facebook. If you're looking for real-time, 24-7 coverage on the latest aviation and aerospace stories, check out aero-news.net. Have a wonderful weekend and I'll see you on Monday.